What's up YouTube? Today we're doing an unboxing, a review of the legendary Star Lord. Who? New White Sheep's Lover screen printed jacket. Check it out. Okay, so I cut to the chase. I used my handy dandy Frank Castle Punisher knife. Took out the, the DHL. I got two things that came in today, but one of them is this. I know, you've seen me do Star Lord. You've seen me do the leather. You've seen me do the four way stretch. You've not seen this. And this is the first one that came out. That's, I'm excited. The first one that came out, you heard it again. The first one that came out of White Sheep's Leather screen printed star lord jacket okay there was a lot of painstaking work to get all the the photos that i possibly can get to them to make this as screen accurate as effing possible a-holes okay and i think it's a beautiful jacket beautiful 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 but we're gonna go over a few things okay i it's a little bit wrinkled because you know it's traveled and it got here really quick. It was a long wait. I got it at a good price because I got it on their discount. But boy, did I have to wait, but it was worth it. Thank you, White Sheep's Lover, for, for even doubting me. Now, look at some of these textures. Man, and there's two different types of te textures in this jacket, okay? Plus, this is real leather. It's an amazing, amazing looking jacket. We're going to do a test fitting with this. Okay, now if I missed anything, hey, um, it's very minute, okay? Now, this um, interior is a lot lighter than their uh, stretch, but that's okay. Nothing that an airbrush uh, can't fix, but I actually like it. It's, it'll be an easy uh, way to, for me to darken. I'm still going to distress it. What's a Star Lord jacket without a distressing? It's beautiful. I was like concerned. Um, I've not felt their screen printed um, material before. It's new. And in saying that this is, uh, I think it's what's used in probably their Daredevil. It's, um, it's got like a certain cool shine to it, which gives it a more leather look, actually. So it, it does have like a leather look, but it isn't. This is a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful jacket. Um, I guess I might have to retire my other two. Um, it doesn't get much better than this. Not in my opinion. Um, zippers on the sleeves as opposed to this is fabric. It seems durable. Now, let's see if they pass the measurement part of this. Because I'm going to try this bad boy on. Be right back. F and A. This is the fizz arm. Let me move this camera a little bit. Okay. I'm liking that they did exactly what I asked them to. Give me a little bit of space over here. Um, lift up the torso. The Star Lord's jacket is not very long. Um, it's actually short, so you can see some of the belt. And they did give me more breathing room than they did in the past. Okay. So I, I also asked them to make sure that the sleeves were more tapered and the length of the sleeves is spot on like spot on man look at this okay i'm loving the textured look um i want to send a shout out to caleb haynes for um giving me a few more um references that i had to send to them it was reference after reference after reference after reference after reference and pictures and pictures and pictures and pictures and pictures that we needed from chris pratt's jacket in order to make this happen and um it's, it's a kick-ass jacket. I'm sure anyone that cosplays Star Lord is going to want an upgrade from this. I got it at a good price. Hit him at the right time. Um, let me get a close-up of this bad boy. Hit him at the right time. And um, got them when they were doing the specials. Um, this is not a catalog piece as far as I know, but I'm sure that it probably will be. Um, on that note, what do I rate this jacket? There's a one out of five. This thing has to exceed it and be a six, seven. I mean, 
the mobility, the, the look, the feel. I mean, this is a, a real special thing for me. I love the character Star-Lord and um, yeah, this is it. <laughs> I mean, as far as I'm concerned, it doesn't get much better than this. I want to give a shout out to White Sheep's Leather. Thank you again for making this come true. Got a new Bucky Cat um, coming in. Um, don't forget to hit the like, subscribe, the notification, tell a friend, to tell a friend, to tell a friend. And I was the first one to take a risk on this, man. You know what I'm saying? So, as I said, I take the risk so you don't have to. Now that I did, don't forget to tell a friend, to tell a friend, to tell a friend. Hit the like, subscribe, the notification. Peace, a-hole.